come from? Yes. No. Don't tell mom and dad. I'll do your lunch for you. That's funny, because I don't believe you at all. What? Well, but you know, as the older sister, I need to ask you something. I need you to be real honest with me, because, let's see, you and John have been dating for, what, six months now? And it's just weird because you guys spend a lot of time together. Maybe too much time, but <sighs> something I've been wanting to ask you. I know it's awkward and it's very accountable, at least for me or for you, but we're both girls and we're both adults. Well, I am, at least, but I mean... You're only 16, so I think it's good for you and I to have this talk because mom and dad will talk about it with us. Let me get to the point. Are you and John, you know, are you and John, you know, what? No. Are you guys, oh, I'm say this. Are you guys doing it? Oh gosh. But you never ask. But yeah, kind of. Why? I mean, you don't have to be embarrassed about this. I just I wanted to talk about it because when I was your age, no one taught me about safe sex. No one taught me about condoms or how to use a condom. I, I, never, I never heard of contraceptives before. And I don't know. I just felt like at your age, you should know about this stuff. Because luckily for me, I had a friend at the time who was a year older than me. And... She knew a lot about that stuff, and she taught me, and so even from, even today, like, I'm very thankful for her for telling me this stuff, and, you know, I wanted to be a role model to you, you know, like, you can ask me questions about this stuff, because it's important to know, you know, to have safe sex, and to know about birth controls, and it's a woman thing, and I think it's important for you to know, so that, you can one day tell your kids. Are you trying to ask if we use protection? Are you? Well, yeah, but what if the condom breaks? I mean, I'm scared that might not work. I can teach you, or I can give you a lesson. But, um, it's probably better if you watch a YouTube video because it teach you probably how to put on a condom. I mean, have you heard of birth controls or Plan B at all? Yeah, sort of, but where can I get them? So, have you and John talked about contraceptives at all? No. Oh. Well, it's funny because I was reading a study, you know, a study that was done at the U of M campus, and I think, I believe it was 100, or no, 800, no, around 800 Asian American women from 12 different ethnicities that were, where they responded to a survey, and it was an open-ended survey, and the topic was about, um, how much role the partner has in the woman choosing contraceptives and the findings, the end results show that their partner had either no role or little role in contraceptive choice. I mean, so that's just like an example I want to use because I think it's important.
for John to have a say in you wanting to go to birth controls or if you do. But I also think it's more important that he cares about your health enough to talk about contraceptive and that whatever decision you choose, he will support it. So it is your body and it is your choice at the end. But you know, if it's still important though for you to yun to talk about it. Yeah, that's true. I don't want to go on birth controls. And I think John would be really supportive of me. He's really understanding. And you're right, it is important for him to be in control of my own health. It's important for you to take care of your own health. Oh, and also the survey or the study I was telling you about, it also said that condoms were the number one contraceptive use method. And then birth control is second, and then the third method is no method. <laughs> I know it's kind of weird, but I think a lot of people just use condoms because it's more available to them. And also you're only 16, so you don't really know where to get birth controls, but you can get it from Planned Parenthood or any other clinics. Oh, can you? Yeah, I mean, I can help you get set up if you want. I mean, you shouldn't be afraid to ask me. I am here to help you, and um, yeah. Don't be afraid to ask. It's better to be safe than sorry. Thanks, sis. I'm glad I can talk to you about this. Yeah! Anytime, little sister.